morning, Cougars. I'm Dylan, along with Mason, and this is the Channel 11 News. Coming up in our newscast, we will have our weekly principal report with Mr. Nazar, and a reminder about Homer Club. But here, first, here's Mason with our top story of the day. Attention all students, tomorrow is Spirit Friday, and every person who dresses up counts towards Class of the Year points, so make sure to wear that black and orange with pride tomorrow. How can you add to your high school memories? Get involved! Our annual club jam will be held Friday, September 23rd in the quad at lunch. Plan to come by and see what clubs are available on campus. Now here, here's Mr. Nazar with the weekly update. Good morning. I want to say uh, we had back to school night last night and our, I want to first of all congratulate and thank our band, our uh, cheerleaders, our leadership class for all that they provided and helped make it such a successful night. Your parents uh, were here in huge droves, and it was absolutely a packed last night, and the energy was so positive. As I went from class to class, I saw teachers really showing your parents what you're going to be doing, how to be successful in your classes, but also the spirit of our leadership class, our cheerleaders that were giving directions, and our band who provided some great music for all the people beforehand really contributed to making this a great evening and I thank all of you uh, for that. The one issue that I uh, want to kind of address today a little bit is, and it's not a major one, but I do, as the weather right now is pretty warm, that I do ask that every one of us behave and especially dress like you're coming to work. Look at your role as a student as your job. There is nothing more important you're doing in your life right now than being the best student and best contributor to our school. And that's part of like when you go to work. If you look at your parents and most of the people, they dress differently when they're at work than there are, let's say, on a weekend. So, you know, where whatever you're thinking about, is this appropriate? Is this appropriate for the workplace that I'm going to? So I am mentally, I am physically ready to go and be the best student I possibly can, along with behavior language, those kind of things. You don't need to use you know, foul language and try to draw attention to yourself in that way. We are better than that. Every one of you are. This is your workplace. This is a place where all of us are moving forward and learning and progressing. We want it to feel good and safe for all of us. So think about that and make sure that you keep that conscious effort to change that. For all of us, let's work hard. Let's be kind to one another. Have a great day. And now, back to the Channel 11 news team. Thanks, Mr. Nazar. Do you need community service hours? We need six kids to help at the Healthy Kids Fair this Sunday, September 11th, 9 a.m. to 4 p.m. See Ms. Zamet for more info. Do you like free tutoring? Homer Club is back and ready for you. The library will be open Monday through Thursday until 4.15. Please stop by and use all of your resources available here to you at HMBHS. Hey Cougars, the Songwriting Club will be having its first meeting of the year today at lunchtime in the band room. Come join us if you already write music, poetry, or beats. Feel free to bring samples of what you do. We'll be discussing club officers, our musical influences, and goals for future meetings. We plan to have a collective album by June. That's today in the band room. See you there. There will be a surf club meeting today at lunch in Miss Spenson's room, D4 slash D6. Pizza will be provided. All surf club and surf team members are required to come. Attention all students interested in joining the HMBHS California Scholarship Federation, or CSF Club. We will be holding a mandatory informational session with the club elections at lunch in Ms. Hozell's room, K4, on Monday, September 12th. If you plan on applying to CSF this year, your presence is required. Attention all ag students, Monday the 12th is our first FFA general meeting in Ms. Smith's room, K6. There will be fun activities during the meeting, and after the meeting, frozen goodies will be passed out. This is your first opportunity to earn FFA points. Hope to see you there. Now here's Tony with the sports. Both football teams will be back in action tomorrow when they jump to Cappuccino High School to take on the Mustangs. The JV game begins at 4, and the varsity game will kick off at 7. Early release, please excuse the following team today. JV Girls Water Polo at 2.30. Thanks for watching the Campus News on our school web homepage.